Hello everybody, Berto Guy here, and welcome back to Core Keeper. Alright, so in between episodes, I've been a little, little, little bit busy. So, uh, as you see here on the map, I've kind of started doing more base building. So we got a little village over here. This is where we're going to store all of our items. These are our armors. These are going to be our wood farms. We'll go over there shortly. Then we'll have farms going all the way around. This is my goal. So let's go have a look at what I've done. <clears throat> so we got our little fishing village started here. Or a little fishing village. Our little village. So we're doing pretty good on that. Uh, doo -doo -doo. There's one thing we can add today to that village. Uh, we got it in the last battle. Uh, was it here? Yeah, it's this one right here. So this should get us a new NPC. He should be like a fisherman NPC. So we'll go and we'll put that uh, right here in the corner. We should get him anytime. There we go. And we got a new fisherman. So we can buy bait um, and some necklaces that I've already gotten. <clears throat> Rings. Uh, bait. What we can use for fishing and different types of fish. Oh, interesting. Cool. So we, now we got a new NPC. So we're going to need his purple bait uh, today anyways, because we want to be going somewhere and doing stuff. <laughs> so I want to go up to the sea today. Uh, my first main goal is to collect wood. So that way we can uh, add it to our wood farm. And I'll show you what I got going here. This is going to be like a armor area. Um, still going to decorate it more, but it's just basic layout. So we got our wood farms going up over here. Um, hard to see a little bit, but they're all fully grown, ready to go. So I just got to flip the lever and I'll get wood. And this side here, I'm going to turn it into planks. So I'm probably going to get rid of this conveyor belt and um, end up putting arms and saw uh, arms and the sawmills behind it and all that good stuff. So yeah, that's uh, that's all that. And then I want to get the, the new different woods and add them to here because uh, we're kind of missing that. So we're going to go up top here and we're going to go up into the sea area and go check that out. All right, we're here. We're in the scary area. So let's uh, get us some wood here. And we'll try to... Should try to get some of that blue stuff too. That'd be pretty good for a mob farm. Aha, nice try. Nice try. Get them, boys. Ah. Over here. Over here, get this guy. Help me, I'm defenseless. I'm here collecting wood. Alright, found something else too. Oh, a tome of the deep. Actually, that wouldn't be too bad to carry around. If I'm not mistaken, that's the one that um, had to put stuff around you. I'll show you in a second. How many seeds we got here? Coral with seeds. We're up to four. Four is better than none. <clears throat> For all the wood that I've collected here so far, we only got four seeds. It's pretty crazy. What was that? I just have value. Alright, so this one here is this. So we can do something like that. <laughs> Which is kind of handy. It's just kind of handy. So what'd you drop? Alright. No clue. Let's continue on doing what I was doing here. Oh, another iron node down here. That's pretty sick. Got lots of iron. I'm really happy about that. We'll have to come back and actually start harvesting all this stuff at one point or another. Here, let's see if we can wake him up. <laughs> I think he's up now. Out of boys. Shit, no. <laughs> oh, that's horrible. Alright, so I got my stuff back. Yeah. Oh. Sniper. Another bloody iron node. That's pretty awesome. 
There's like three of them all the way right around here. Thank you very much. That was pretty sick. Alright, so I think we did pretty good for that quick little adventure. And we got uh, coral wood seeds. We got ten of them. We got a bunch of papaya seeds and pineapple seeds. That's pretty cool. So it'll be good for our farming later on. So we'll go home. We'll plant these. And we'll also... Um, start making planks out of these things here because that's what we need we need some planks so now that we got all the um was it the coral wood seeds planted they'll grow up and they'll make nice long stretches and then what we'll do is we'll just put a drill at the bottom for now just so we can collect more seeds and more wood but for the meantime the wood that we did collect we can go and start putting that into a sawmill and I believe I have one lying around somewhere. If not, well, I'll make one and we'll hook it up. So we're just gonna do a little cheesy setup like this where we put the sawmills in between a generator. So now we got uh, two of these making planks. And the reason why we wanna make planks is because we go over here to the boat um, crafting table, we can make the speeder boat. And it is a hundred times better than this thing right here. And at least we'll have a chance of staying alive while out in a boat as to oppose of being hit by everything while we're on this thing. All right, so I'm going to let that go and we'll come back when uh, we got enough planks to do what we want to do here. All right, so now that we got all the wood that we need, we should be able to make the speedboat, which is pretty freaking awesome. All right. So now that we have that, we need to do a few other things as well. So my goal is to try to beat the bosses today. So we have two bosses that we need to beat. All right. So now that we have the boat, what we want to do now is we want to go after uh, Ormoroth, the Sea Titan. And we're going to go after Morpha, the Aquatic Mass. Uh, we need to go collect some more slippery slime. Uh, we only have 23 of it and we need to go get more seashells because we only have seven. So let's head off back up into the sea area and get some of that stuff. Oh boy. Okay. So this, this in particular room is extremely important. Um, I was looking for this room in my game with my friend. Um, if you're looking for the bow, you're going to want to mark this on your map. So one thing I will do is I will mark this on the map. Ah, okay. Middle mouse button. Middle mouse button. So I'm going to put a treasure here for later. So that way I know uh, that there's something important here. That way if I ever decide to go for the bow just for giggles, well, then I know where this room is. Let's continue. We need seashells. Oh, too bad we don't have a music thing. I'm going to mark this on our map for music. So, I guess we'll go question X, uh, the flags for music. More blue slime. Get them, boys. Give me your slime. Excellent. I'll leave this stuff here on the ground so that way you can spawn more, maybe. Oh, that's a sea a seashell he dropped up there. So this is kind of like what we're looking for. We need uh, a bunch more of them. Considering that was like the first one I've gotten so far. So we found one of these uh, octane nodes. That's pretty awesome. And we'll have to come back and hopefully hook that up one day. <laughs> oh, we hit the jackpot over here. Two of them in one area. That's nice. That's a nice tree. Maybe you can get through here. Hmm. Bombs, maybe. Oh, look at that. There's an entrance right here. Sweet. Let's go check it out. Alright, what's this? I'm just a valuable. I like these pedestals. If I find lots of them, I'll be using lots of these. I gotta pay attention. There was a whole bunch on the ground here. Some more here. I think we got enough uh, of these cell shells now. Now we just gotta concentrate on blue, on blue slimes. 
Oh, well, it looks at this. We found a teleporter way out here. Hmm. This is so awesome. Does that mean this is where the boss is? <laughs> That'd be pretty dope. Yep. So this is where we're going to summon the boss. Well, that's pretty awesome. That is so very awesome. So it looks like we don't need to get... <laughs> Uh, we just need the blue slime one. That's pretty crazy. I didn't think I'd actually come across this, but that's freaking awesome. Alright, so I guess uh I guess now we just need to get the blue slime and do the boss, do that one boss. Alright, so since we're looking for blue slime, I figured we would um maybe use these things here. These are the crown summonings. These ones should be able to summon the, um, what the hell is it called? The king slime. He's a blue slime. So hopefully that kind of works. And we can get a bunch of blue slime from him maybe. We just got to keep him away from. So that's a bunch of blue slime. That's good. Just let the, the minions do their thing. Try to concentrate on killing some blue slime here. Not bad, not bad. So, I don't know if they're dropping any blue slime, though. Can you drop any blue slime? It's just an idea. Doesn't look like it. Alright, so we did get them. That's good. I don't see them dropping any blue slime though. That's unfortunate. So what do we get here? Uh, figurine. We got a royal ooze egg. I guess that's maybe you get our own slime pet. A royal gel. Nice, nice. And then the crown. Oh, so if I wear both of these things, slimes don't hurt me. That's kind of cool. All right, let's bring that home. We'll do one more time since we had two of them, right? Why not? There we go. Attack them, boys. Shouldn't be much of an issue. We've already done it once. <laughs> No match for me. Not at all. Me and my amazing minions. As long as I stay dodgy dodge there, we're good. Oh crap. Get out of there. <laughs> Kinda dodge the wrong way. Not too bad, not too bad. Same crap. Pretty much all the exact same stuff. That's what I thought. All right, cool. All right, well, that's it was worth a try. This is pretty cool. Look at the big seashell in there. There's all the seashells on it on the side of it. Let's get out here. Oh, there's something in there though. Look like I had a necklace. Conch shell. Dodge chance. Ah, that's neat. Alright, so we got kind of like a clam chest here. Oh, a bunch of fishing stuff in it. That's kind of cool. Saves me from having to uh, buy it later. Looks like we got like a, maybe a little village or something over here. Go have a little gander. Oh, fish on the table. 
There's a fishing rod there. A boat uh, place. We got some keys in here. A galaxite key. Nice. Oh, you're on one of those mapping tables. I'll take that. Ooh, the serpent. That's pretty cool. Hey, buddy. We're going to fight soon, man. Yeah, yeah, we are. We're going to fight soon. I'm going to kick your ass. So this is uh, one of the temples that uh, you're going to be wanting to look for if you want to get the, uh, the really good bow. So I'm just going to mark this on the map. I'm going to mark it with a uh, flag. And then that way I know that's where that is. So we found uh, another musical note door, so we'll mark this on the map. It was pretty neat. We found like a little dinosaur that's stuck in here. Look at all the seashells around this guy. Spine ring. Cool. Valuable, valuable. All right, so it looks like we have everything we need in order to go get the two bosses. Um, we got this to find where the more for the aquatic masses, and this is what we're going to need in order to fight the boss, in order to lure him out of the water to speak. All right, let's put these back, then put this one here. Let's go find out where that big blob is. have a look at the map we weren't that far off that's pretty crazy all right so let's go up there and um, we'll unlock another teleport too at the same time so let's head up there I was looking for this for a while like I found the boss and I was like oh well I'll go look around for the teleporter all the way around here whatever you know, meanwhile, it's on a little island right above them. Like, for crying out loud. <laughs> Alright, let's go uh, back home right quick. Alright, let's do this, everybody. Here we go. There we go. Open the area for me, man. Open it. Oh, crap. That's not good. Look, he's got bubbles. No, get away from me. <laughs> All those damn bubbles. Oh, crap. Get him, boys. Crap, dude, that's a lot of bubbles he's pushing out there. Might have to get some new guys out here right quick. Back to my healing. It's the only thing keeping me alive. Oh, I wonder if I could do the same trick I was doing the last time. Oh, God. Oh, shit. I guess not. That's not good. <laughs> All right, guys, get him. We'll try to do our best here. Got him in half. Get him to do a little bit of a walk around. Oh, man. It's like a bloody tank, though. And every time I go to heal, some friggin' bubble friggin' hits me. Oh. Screw you, buddy. 
You're gonna go sliding around on all your crap anymore. Oh. <laughs> These friggin' bubbles, man. These friggin' bubbles. I'm telling you. You're gonna be the death of me. <laughs> Ah, oh, for Christ's sakes. I think I found the optimal position where I should be able to just sit here and cheese them. <laughs> you know, third time's the cheese, right? And there we go. After a little bit of cheese, we did it. Because third time's the cheese, right? Let's get my stuff back. What do we get in here? We got some sorcerer pants, a bunch of blue slime, and a morphous ring. Interesting. All right, so here we are over at the uh, boss area. So we put the uh, boat in the water, then we put this in our offhand, and we'll just put that there. And then we just uh, jump in here. So in order to um, to get him out here, we're gonna have to fish in one of these little spots. And this is what's going to lure him out here. And then we have to sit there and fight him in here. So let's do that. Oh, crap. There we go. And there's our guy. And then now we just got to fight him. Not really sure how this boss battle goes. All right, so far so good, I guess. Just let our minions do the work. Try to bring up our mana. He's gonna come down here and out. Oh, so that crap blows you around. That's kind of neat. So far so good. A little easier than the slime boss, actually. <laughs> Crap. Don't put yourself in precarious positions. There you go. Just pay attention. Let you guys do the work. Let you guys do the work. Get ready to start healing another another batch. I'll put a four more. It's pretty good so far. Pretty good so far. Oof. That was a lot of them. There you go. So far, so good, man. So far, so good. Let's, uh, end heal. I think we're doing great. Oh, he's down back here. Not too shabby. Don't seem like we're doing a whole ton of damage to him, though. From the too bad though. Oh, I should uh, heal myself. Where's he's gonna pop up here? Up in the middle. Get some new batches of minions out there. Oh crap. Okay, so it's starting to get a little bit uh, more difficult. Oh shit, huh? And my boat's there too. That's not cool. <laughs> You're going down, buddy. You're going down. Yep. Yeah. Down here. No, no, I clicked off friggin' screen. Ah! All right, ladies and gentlemen, third time's a charm. This time I went and made potions. 30 magic damage more. We got 34 armor. Uh, we got minion damage more. And then I just made some more health potions, some bigger ones, so that way we heal more at a time. And then, yeah, let's see if we can do this this time. My God. 
It's absolutely insane. <laughs> Let's get some minions out here. Just about dead. Come on. Come on. It's just about bloody dead. We can do it, guys. Yes. <laughs> Holy shit. Third time's the charm. Oh, yes. All right. So this thing, I know what it is now. It's the thing that holds the soul to the... Uh, <laughs> to the, uh, the, the... In particular, Titan. Oh, my Jesus. Oh, yeah. Okay. Later, bud. <laughs> Oh, I can't believe we did that. That's great. Oh, I'm so excited. All right. Oh, well. Good stuff. Good stuff. Let's go home before something else tries to kill us. Ah, <clears throat> oh, let's have a seat because we deserve that. All right. What did we look? What did we get here? Got a moonstone damaged thing with a mana pool can be equipped off hand. Okay, so we sacrifice some mana for that. Alright. A chest plate, that's good for melee. And that was about it. Man, oh man, what a battle, everybody. What an absolute battle. Third time's the charm for like three bosses or two of the three bosses, anyways. Wow. Well, anyways, that's going to be all I have time for today. I hope you enjoyed the video, everybody. Like, subscribe, peace, take care, and we'll see you next time. Bye-bye.